Hey guys, what's up? It's Anna Louise, and I am back. And I know I've been gone for a while, obviously. Okay, good, my car's in park. Sometimes I park and decide not to put my car in park and leave it in drive, and yeah, I have issues sometimes. But anyway, I am back. I am in my car. I decided to vlog today. Um, I've been wanting to do it for a while, but, you know, just things been getting in the way. You know, things still haven't gotten back to normal from the original, I guess you say, fallout of me not posting videos regularly, reg regular, regularly, if I can talk. Um, but, you know, I really want to get back into it because I really miss doing this. I really miss you guys. And, you know, it's just going to take some time. Um, but anyway, I've said this in the last, like, I don't know how many videos I made. Oh, gosh, okay. How's the lighting? I do not know. Uh, I apologize if the lighting like all messed up but anyway um what was i saying i don't remember but anyway um just go ahead and get into the vlogging i have a lot actually a lot of good things to talk about a lot of things to tell you that i'm excited about and i may actually make this into a two day vlog not for sure because i'm not for sure how today's necessarily gonna completely go um so this may be like all in one day or it may be like a two day thing not for sure but like the main things I want to talk to you about are um, getting a new kitten um, ordering from Tiffany's and what was the other one? Oh yeah summer school and no not like high school summer school like if you did bad you know not that kind of thing um, I am in college if you haven't um, seen any of my other videos and I decided to take uh, classes over the summer. Now, I thought this was a great idea. Um, I'm not good at math at all. Like, math is terrible for me. And um, I'm a sophomore in college now. Um, and I took math my first year, got in a couple weeks, realized that the teacher, he is, uh, let's see, he's the baseball coach for my college that I go to. And I've never had any kind of good luck with teachers that are also coaches and you know this just proved to be another one of those times and um, I'm not just blaming it on him well actually I kind of am because in high school I had this one teacher and I got a 100 in math he worked with me he tried with me whatever whatever you know etc etc but this teacher it just was not happening and I know are happening and I know college is different but anyway Long story short, I ended up dropping out of that one class, and I decided to take math again over the summer so that my math whiz of a boyfriend could be home and actually help me, and so I could do it online, and then maybe he could actually help, um, because my boyfriend does go away to college, and, you know, he can try to help over the phone, but it's just not the same, especially for someone like me who, you know, sucks at math, like, literally sucks, and oh my god, my arm hurts, okay, um. Let me try to turn around this way. All right, that is a better. All right. Um. So anyway, um, which I guess basically goes for another point. Um. Um. On why I haven't been filming, and I'll just throw this in really fast. Along with the other main health issue that I have, which I've talked about before, not gotten into like what it is. I've also gotten diagnosed with neuropathy and fibromyalgia, and so just if you don't know what that is especially like fibromyalgia and stuff it's widespread widespread body pain and like overactive nerves so it's, it's really hurting to hold my camera up here and I don't have like a place to place to put it but anyway I'm gonna try to rest my arm on the side of my car um I actually have just I'm sorry this is really all over the place but I've just gotten out of my house to go get lunch um, I mentioned in the last vlog that I had my nephew and he's at the house every day while my sister and brother-in-law are at work. And so there's really not any good time to film in the house. And so I'm doing a vlog anyway, so I was like, why not just do it in my car? Um, at least for right now. But um, anyway, back to the whole school thing. So I'm taking classes over the summer. Um, they're not through the college that I go to, uh, like... In general, they're through two different colleges, one university in my, t or in my Tennessee, in my state, and the other one is through a community college also in my state, and um, 
I went to go log on yesterday, which, let me say, was really hard, and put in my little access code that I have to have for the class, which also, let me say, had to pay $249 for a code. That crazy. So I had that to do, and I had two of those, and the codes wouldn't work. And then I look on, um, like, the course info, and everything seems so much more difficult than my normal college situation. So I'm sitting here just staring at this, paying over $1,000 for the course just in general, just in general, without the access codes. And I'm sitting here like, this is probably just going to be a big mistake. It is so overwhelming. I haven't figured out any of it. My boyfriend's moving into a new house, so he hasn't gotten the chance to like come over and help or anything with it. And so I'm waiting for that to see how it's going to go. But I'm really nervous this is going to be like a waste. Because I, when I say I suck at math, like I literally mean I suck at it. And I have two classes that I'm enrolled in right now for math. And one of them is for elementary school's concepts and the other one is just a regular math. And the one that's supposed to be for elementary school is like for my major. And now you would think teaching elementary school math, I should be able to do that, right? Well, no. Everything in that damn course is like college level math. I don't even see how that makes sense. So, it's another hard math course as to where it should be just like simple adding, subtracting, multiplying. I don't know. My degree is K through 5th. But anyway, uh, that's just something else to have to worry about over the summer when I thought it was going to be easy. Because I have taken online classes before and I actually really loved them through my college um, that I actually go to. So anyway, I thought that this would be easy, but apparently, I don't know. But anyway, on another note, another thing to mention is the new kitty cat, which I'm really excited about. It's not mine. Well, it's mine and my boyfriend's together. It's like our fur baby, but it's for him at his house. Um, I don't know if y'all knew or if y'all seen the video, but I, we did have a little fur baby hamster together who unfortunately had to be put to sleep. A couple months ago, he got sick, and I don't know how it, was ha it happened. It was like a freak accident. Um, but anyway, so my boyfriend's been wanting a cat for a really long time, but his mom's allergic, and they're moving into a new house that, um, has a barn and, like, a lot of acres, and so he can be, like, a little outside cat, and hopefully I have a really good chance of not getting hurt, because I hate having outside animals. I've had outside cats before, and not one time has it turned out great, but I think this will be a good situation, and he can have one without, you know, his mom having issues with being allergic. Um, and the little kitty is so precious, and we're, I'm thinking, hopefully, maybe going to pick it up today. That's why I don't know if this is going to be, like, a one-day vlog or a two-day vlog kind of ordeal, because they're moving into their new house, and they got screwed over, like, with the moving company, so they had to move, like, all by themselves, and it's just, it's been a lot, like, more hectic than it should have been, and, uh, so yeah, and yesterday was actually... Not yesterday, sorry. Two days ago, my boyfriend's 20th birthday. So, you know, that was like his birthday present, or one of them, from his mom. Um, and we've actually went to go visit the cat before. Once again, I apologize if this is all over the place. Uh, just bear with me. I have not vlogged or made a video in a long time. So it's kind of like starting over, in a way. Um, but anyway, we went to go visit the little cat. It's not any kind of sort of breed. It's just a regular cat. Um, just like a tabby or a house cat I guess um trying to find a picture right now to show you um it's funny my boyfriend has decided to name the cat Biscuit which I am one like my cat's name is Rose and I have a dog named Wally I like naming animals oh shit okay sorry I thought somebody was like pulling into the driveway um I'm in a church right now my granny's church actually but anyway um I like to name my pets like human names and yeah, I don't know. He wanted to name it Biscuit, so. Here is Biscuit. He is so cute. He has, like, a little mustache. I like the name Biscuit, though. It's not a problem. I just think it's cute and funny that my boyfriend wanted to name him that. And the middle name for Biscuit is Gene. Okay, so the whole, like, thing behind the name Biscuit Gene is, like, Michael Jackson. The and Michael Jackson's song, Billy Jean, instead of Billy Jean, is Biscuit Gene. And, like, yeah. So that's why the little kitty cat's name is Biscuit Jean. But anyway, I'm really excited to go get Biscuit. And I really wanted to vlog that experience and show you guys. Because, like I say, I thought it would be a really good like thing to vlog. And I haven't vlogged in a long time. So I'm hoping I can do that. 
it just kind of depends on when we get to go get him but he's so cute so sweet and i just love kittens so much honestly like kittens or cats in general are like my favorite animal they just have to be um, i love dogs too so it's really really hard to choose but i love 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 cats and i can't wait to go pick him up because literally we when we went to go visit him we were in a room full of like five little kittens and oh my god they were just they were just so cute and so small and it's been a while since i've been able to be around little little bitty animals because my mom said no more animals so my animals are grown and very sassy so hopefully a little biscuit won't turn out to be sassy although i know cats are more independent on their own anyway um but anyway and the third main topic i wanted to talk to you guys about is tiffany so for a long time i've been wanting to have a piece of jewelry from tiffany's and i hope to kind of make it a tradition like start out getting with one piece and then maybe for like my birthday get another piece um and i really want to get a necklace for my first actual piece of jewelry but like i've wanted um a piece of jewelry in general from there for a while and it does kind of have some sentimental value because of breakfast at tiffany's with audrey hepburn if you haven't seen the movie go watch it it's a classic but um it just has sentimental value especially with the movie because of my grandma and tiffany's is like a classic i mean it's like an icon and i really want to have a piece of jewelry or multiple pieces of jewelry just depending on how it goes um to hopefully pass down to my daughter one day hopefully i will get to have a daughter um, and I would like for her to have it one day and then for me to have it now. And I graduated a little over a year ago from high school and I have all my graduation money. And my mom said I can't just spend it on anything, like not just clothes or, you know, makeup. She wants me to spend it on something that, like, I'm going to look back and not regret. And I finally, over a year later, decided that's what I want to spend my money on. And I'm going to get out my phone out again. I cannot decide which one I want. I'm between two and yes, I do have a favorite out of the two. Um, but the issue is, alright, so, and if you follow me on Instagram, which, uh, my Instagram is it's underscore Anna Louise, you may have seen this post already, but this is one of them, and this is my ultimate favorite, but the pendant is small, as to where I also like this one, sorry, hold on, having to do this with one hand is hard, alright, and then there's this one, which the pendant is bigger. I like the first one because it has the Tiffany blue with it, but like I said, the pendant size is smaller, so, you know, getting this piece of expensive jewelry, I want to be able to wear it and people to be able to look at it and be like, oh, you know, she's wearing something from Tiffany's, and I don't know if the smaller one will be like that, so I don't know if I should go with the smaller one that I like a little bit more or go with the bigger one so it's really hard I don't know leave your comments down below on which one you like better honestly I don't know if the video will be up by the time I already order it but still I would like to know just in case I haven't ordered it yet because it is a big decision I just don't know whether I want the smaller one that I like a little bit more or the bigger one that I know for sure people will be able to tell that it says return to the return to Tiffany's but anyway, that is the deal with everything so far. And right now, I'm starving, like absolutely hungry. I had to get up so early this morning to, um... Oh my god, when I was telling you about school, did I even tell you my issue? I don't know if I did. Oh my god. Well, if I didn't, I'm telling you again. So this morning, I had to wake up because my access code did not work last night when I was trying to log on to my classes. So, basically, I had to get up, call the bookstore that I ordered the access code from, and try to figure out what the heck was going on, and it, it took forever, and I was starving. I couldn't, like, leave my computer, because I don't like setting my email up on my phone. I don't know why, but I just, I never have, and so, like, I'm glued to my MacBook, like, hello, when are you going to email me back? So, I called about it, and the lady hung up, and she's like, well, I'll email you, blah, blah, blah. So... It took forever, then I had to hurry up and get ready, which I actually like. I don't know if you can tell. Um, I really like my makeup today. I'm wearing Mother by Kat Von D, and then I have my Too Faced um, Bon Bon's collection or palette on my eyes. And I really like my makeup, but anyway, had to hurry up and get ready, and then I came here to vlog, and I'm hungry. It's past my lunch time. I'm being a little titty baby about it, but anyway, I'm going to go get food now. And, yeah, I will be back soon. I'm just going to get out of this church parking lot. Hopefully nobody's, like, seen me just sitting here and, like, wondering what I'm doing. So, yeah. Bye. 
Okay guys, so I'm home and really mad because whenever I got to the restaurant, I turned on my camera and for some reason it froze and it's never done that before. Oh my god. Eh. So ignore that on the wall. Yeah, the wallpaper is kind of coming off. Anyway, um, I'm home and I have a second to record because my nephew and dad are on the porch. So yeah, but when I got to the restaurant, my stupid camera broke, or not broke, but froze. Could not get it to work. Then when I finally did, um, it said battery exhausted, so now I'm sitting here with it plugged up. But anyway, I went to my favorite restaurant ever, which if you're not from the south, then you probably don't know this restaurant, but it is Zagsby's, and they are a chicken restaurant, and chicken is like my most favorite thing ever. And um, if you've seen any of my other videos before, you know I've mentioned that I am really not the healthiest eater, and I'm really trying to work on that. Um... So, whenever I go to get fast food now, I get it in smaller portions. So, this is just a kid's meal. And, of course, you could probably tell that. And then it comes with this super small drink, which I got Dr. Pepper. Um, but I have been trying to eat healthier. Um, but, like I say, when I do get fast food, I get smaller portions. And then, also, I've been drinking a lot more water, which is really good. I've been drinking um, four water bottles what I'm supposed to be drinking. I've done that some, but at least a minimum of two. But I've been trying to work my way up because if you know me, I hate water. It makes me gag. Literally, hate water so much. But I got to where it was really easy and I've had a lot of health problems. Like I say more recently, obviously the fibromyalgia and neuropathy diagnosis, but also I had to get some tests done on my heart. And that just kind of like pushed me into gear of like, I really need to do healthier. Um, and so I did good with water, and then I got sick, like, with, with, um, just a cold, and then it made me start to hate it again, because I literally would gag when I drank water before. So I'm, like, slowly building my way back up with the water thing. But anyway, I'm gonna say Zagsby's is my most favorite food ever, and I'm trying to do it with one hand. But anyway, the kid's meal just comes in a little box like this, and... Literally my favorite chicken in the world. And you only get two little chicken tenders. But I don't eat much anyway, but oh my god, they smell amazing and they are amazing. And then the fries, which come with their special little seasoning, whatever. But anyway, that is my food. Favorite food ever, comfort food, like go-to food. Anytime, could eat it every day. But anyway, yeah, but they are kind of expensive, which it really sucks because that means I don't get to eat it as much. But anyway... Um, I will go eat now, and I will see you guys later. Hey guys, so I realize it's bad lighting, and I'm in my laundry room, so you know what? Just to avoid all the clutter, let me stand behind this white door. Um, my nephew is still here, and he's asleep, so I literally had to come in the most remote room of my house to quickly film, um, but I didn't have the chance to bring my camera, um, with what I'm about to tell you. But I'm so excited because I forgot to tell y'all this morning a big thing that I was going to do. And I've been thinking about this since last night. It's kind of a spur of the moment thing. But as I mentioned earlier in my vlog, I have fibromyalgia and neuropathy. And, you know, you've heard of acupuncture. Um, pain don't bother me, as in, like, needle pains and such. So none of that bothers me whatsoever. And um, if you have any kind of body piercings at all, you may or may not know this, but there are different, like, acupuncture piercings that you can get. And, um, there's one specifically that helps, well, you may have heard of the date piercing that helps with migraines. Well, there's also a study that says it helps with fibromyalgia. And there's also another piercing called, um, it's your conch. And it helps with, like, neuropathy and such, which I have. Um, but, a local tattoo place in my town, which is actually where I got my tattoos, my nose pierced, and my belly button pierced, um, was doing a special this week. If you get your days, it's only for $20. Okay, my mom just came in. But anyway, like I was saying, um, it's a special that if you get your days pierced, you can get it pierced for um, $20. Excuse me. Um, and so, I was like, you know, I mean, like, it's not going to hurt to try it. And so, I love getting piercings anyway and tattoos. I have two tattoos and now... Um, I have seven piercings because I did. I went and got my date pierced today. I didn't obviously have my camera with me. It was a spur of the moment thing. Um, the lighting's getting really bad. But anyway, here it is. And it is just this, this one right here. And I was super excited about it. 
and I'm really happy that I got it done. I don't know if it's going to help or not, you know, and if it doesn't help with fibromyalgia, maybe it'll help with headaches, who knows, but I was really excited to do it, and I really like it, um, and like I said, since I didn't have my camera, I did take, like, a few shots on Snapchat of the tattoo place, which I will insert at the end of this video, so make sure to, um, make sure to look, but yeah, I'm really, really excited about it, honestly, like, I was really nervous about it at first, not for pain, but just because I like to have really cute earrings in, and I always know that they just pierce with just, like, the silver hoop. So I asked beforehand if, like, I could bring in my own jewelry, and they said, yeah, but the quality of theirs, you know, um, is good for the healing process. So I'm just going to leave it in for three weeks and then change it after that to something really cute. But honestly, I really actually do like it, which I will it still change it to something cute, but... It fits in there so cute and nice, and I don't know. I just love getting new piercings and new tattoos, so I'm really happy. And that now makes eight piercings now that I have. I may have said seven, but I actually have eight piercings because I have my first hole, second hole, third hole, cartilage, dath, um, tragus, nose, and my belly button, which I would show you, but I'm wearing a romper. So, yeah. Hello, peoples. Hey, guys. Um, so, yeah. Pretty sure this is crappy lighting. And I apologize for it, but... Um... Whew, what is this? A receipt. For something. Oh, that was for my lunch today. Anyway, I've had a busy day. Um... So, yeah, I just got out of the shower. I left my makeup on. not gonna take it off right now, because I may have to go back out later. I just threw my hair up in a bun and I have all my comfy clothes. It's funny, like I love how I wear my pajamas. Like I love wearing mismatched pajamas for some reason. Like I have this t-shirt on and then I have my little coffee shorts on and then I always have, you can see this house coat and then like some blue fuzzy socks and that is my pajamas. Um, But yeah, I like them and they're comfy but Anyway, like I said, I rinsed off, and now I'm just sitting here and relaxing, and I'm still super happy about my piercing, like, oh my gosh, right there, but yeah, I'm super happy about it, and like I said, even if it don't work like it's supposed to, I really don't care, because I like it, and I'm obsessed with piercings, it's really bad, actually, and I'm already wanting more. Which, honestly, like, the low piercings, I don't know, but do you know how, like, when you take out your earrings, they're hard to clean, and they're, like, really nasty and crap. Sometimes I regret, like, having all of them, but other times I don't. So it's just, like, a odd situation with that. But honestly, really, I really want to make a tattoo tag video, like a tattoo and piercing video. Um, and I may, coming up really soon, um, I want another tattoo also. So that's something to be thrown around. But, sorry. But I don't know, um, I, I really have issues, like, there's tattoos that I want, and, like, I have them planned out, but it's not the fact that I would regret them that bothers me, it's the fact of knowing that I regret the location that I get it in, if that makes sense. So, that's something to think about, and, yeah, but I really do want to make a tattoo and piercing video soon, um, and honestly, this one, this doesn't even hurt afterwards. Like, th like my tragus, which is, what is my problem with coordination? All right, I'm sure you can see this, which is this one right here. Hurt the worst, and it hurt the worst after, whatever, whatever. But this one isn't even hurting. It's weird. But anyway, um, unfortunately, we did not get to go get the kitten today. Things didn't work out that well. So, I think I'm just gonna, like, not make this a weekly vlog, um, but just over a span of a couple days, I'll, since I mentioned about getting the kitten before, I'll just leave this vlog going and pick it up on the day, um, where we get the kitten, which I really don't know when that's gonna be. So, I don't know if I should end the vlog here, or, hmm, or just keep it going. I'll probably just keep it going, honestly. Might as well. I just really want to get something up for you guys, because I know I've been all incognito for forever. Um, but anyway, um, I got my book, or access code stuff figured out, but then 
I get on the stupid thing and it's just, I don't even know. College is just, it, it makes me so mad. Like, honestly, mm, I really wish you guys could see the shit I have to do because it's bull. It really is. I mean, the elementary education math that I'm taking is supposed to be what you teach the elementary school kids. And, I mean, this is kindergarten through fifth. And it is not. It, it like, advanced algebra mess. Like, I, I don't know. It's just, and the websites and everything I have to do it on are confusing. And I'm just really stressed about it. So, I'm about to try to figure that out again. Or maybe I'll just sit and binge watch Friends because that's what I've been doing for the longest. Um, literally, I've been watching Friends, like, every day. Like, all day. Um, if, when I'm not with my boyfriend, because that is, like, my new favorite show, which, I mean, actually, when the show originally first came out, it was my mom's favorite show. Like, it's always been her most favorite show ever, and I've seen bits and pieces of them throughout my life, but now I've really decided just to sit down and actually watch every single one of the episodes, and I love them. I love that show so much, and my mom's actually, the only episode she's never seen is the very last one, so I find that interesting. So, I'm gonna watch the last one, and then... I'll probably play it for her, um, if she wants to. She's not tech savvy, so she doesn't really know about Netflix and stuff. Which, I mean, she knows it exists, but, yeah, she's just not into the, um, my lips are really chugged. That looked really creepy. Okay, sorry. But anyway, she's just really not into, sorry, hold on. Okay, I have this really big window, and my dad um, walked by, and I just didn't want him to sit here or pff, walk by and like see me sitting here recording, because he'd probably be like, what the hell is she doing? Because, yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't, well, I'm, I don't know if they know I do this or not, so I don't want him to just walk by and be like, why is she sitting here talking to her camera? She's creepy. Uh, but anyway, I don't even know what I was talking about now. But, I think, something about Friends. I don't know. But, I'm either going to sit here, watch Friends, or YouTube, or something. Because, honestly, I just don't feel like being frustrated anymore with this math tonight. So, anyway. Yeah, I'm going to end this part of the vlog here. Um, and, I'll probably pick up later, whenever we do get the kitten. Which, I don't know what day that'll be. So, I hope it's soon. If it's not, I'll come back on here, just end the vlog. Um... And then put the kitten one on a different video. Um, but, you know what? Ooh, I forgot. I'm going to order my Tiffany's necklace. Tiffany necklace, whatever. Um, and I did make my decision. So, I will order that soon. I just need to text my mom and make sure the money is all ready to go. But anyway, yeah. So, I will be right back. Okay, you guys. So, I'm dumb. And I don't remember if I told you that I decided about my necklace or not but I did and I just went ahead and went with what my heart originally said and that was to get the one with the blue although it is smaller I mean when you really think about it from far away it's not like people are going to be able to read it anyway so I mean when I'm in close contact talking to people they're going to be able to see it and I mean that's where my heart goes anyway having that splash of blue I mean I have like um tons of necklaces anyway that are just silver and nothing quite like this. And, I mean, it's the classic Tiffany blue. So, well, that's what I'm going to go with. And, yeah, I'm super excited about it. Like I say, it's my graduation money. It's $125. Oh, Lord. Yeah. It's not focusing. But, anyway, it's $125, so it's not bad. But, anyway, I'm going to add it to my shopping bag. And no engraving, obviously. So... Skip the engraving. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and buy it. And then probably going to watch some Netflix. So, peace out guys. And I will talk to you later. Hey guys. So, um, yeah. Obviously very bad lighting. Like, really, really bad lighting. I apologize. Um, But today is the next day. And hence, of course, outfit change. And this fellow sitting right by me. But anyway, unfortunately... <laughs> And he just spilt his drink all over him. Ha ha. But anyway, um, 
unfortunately, just due to just many different circumstances, I don't know where we're going to get the kitten, so I'm just going to go ahead and end the vlog here. But I am excited because I got a ColourPop order in today, and I'll just briefly show you what I got. So, like, right now they're doing a birthday special, like, where if you order $10, then you get, like, a free birthday shadow. And so, let's see. I got an ultra matte lip in the color Chi, and I do not know how to pronounce this, but anyhow, let me get it out. Hard to do with one hand. Okay. And I really like the, the packaging. Sorry, I was having to shake it out, but anyway, I really like the packaging on this with, like, the, or the coppery little circle thing, which is different. And it's really pretty, and it's in the color Chi, and then I got my first ever, like, lip liner pencil to go with it, because I've never gotten one from ColourPop before. Sorry. It's just really hard to do with one hand. But anyway, and then I got the matching little lip pencil to go with it. So, this was $6, and the lip pencil was 5 And then, so, I got the free shadow. Let me switch hands. Okay. Um... Which is this, and it's in this really cute blue packaging, like Tiffany Blue, which obviously I love. As you know, I ordered the necklace yesterday, so. And it comes in this beautiful blue packaging. Like, this is literally, if not my favorite color, it's tied for first of my favorite color, so. And this is in the color Birthday Cake. It's really pretty. I want to take off the lid and show you, so, or my boyfriend will. My magical little assistant. Ugh. Okay, I thought I got some on me, but I didn't. So this is what it looks like. I'm not going to swatch my hand. Um, or put it on my hand, because I don't have anything to wipe it off with right now. I'm lazy. But it's really pretty, and I really like it, so I'm excited. And, yeah, but like I said, I'm just going to go ahead and end this vlog here. And I will post another one whenever we get the kitten so have a great day or night or whenever you're watching this and please make sure to subscribe and give my video a big thumbs up and yeah so bye